Vandy brings an extra defender. The pass is complete. Matt Landers is a guy that Jake Fromm told us in the spring would, quote, wreck the SEC. Now, the coaches are still waiting for Landers to show more consistency, but it seems he has take the lid off kind of town. I mean, he's 6'5", 200 pounds. He can run a 4'4". From right here, he saw the cushion. Vanderbilt given a lot of cushion on the outside, so we audible the four verticals there, but on the outside, with that much cushion, it's just a 10-yard stop route. That's pitch and catch for a quarterback and a receiver like Landers. First catch for Matt Landers in his career. Richard, sophomore from St. Petersburg, Florida. It is always alive. Setting up a screen. Landers cuts it back. Matt Landers, second catch. He's shown a little bit what he can do. It's a game. From will look the other way, the throw to the end zone, incomplete, and a flag down. Matt Land. Exciting plays with their offense, some explosive plays, and that'll be key if they want to beat Georgia, beat Alabama, potentially this year. Matt Landers on the second and six under pressure. Bennett into some traffic, incomplete, looking for Landers. And we've got to George Pickens. Tempo on third down, Fromm off his back foot, floats one deep, incomplete. Matt Landers, the intended receiver. Fourth down upcoming for UGA. Fromm on third and short's going to throw it. Just off the fingertips of Matt Landers. For air and drop it in the pocket instead of drive it past the outreached hand of the wide receiver. Those little use their quickness to their advantage against this big line. Here's a quick throw out in the flats. And again, good open field time. James Cook in motion to the top. Here comes an end around. Great defense. Landers is swarmed under by the very nice addition to this Georgia team, which needed an infusion of talent and wide receiver. From after a pump. Short set by Fromm on target. Matt Landers stacked up after he picked up the first down. Here comes the blitz. Fromm outside. Reaching out to try and pick it off as McCrombo. He's got it. It's a stop route. And the big thing with the stop route is at the top of your Landers come back down where you came from, your stem. He curled inside. Now there's a lot of contact by Mukwamu as well. But Jake Fromm's throwing that ball, anticipating Landers to come back where he came from. He went inside, balling out. Boy, to think about coming off the corner. Fromm pump fakes once, now goes deep. And a flag flies in, C.J. Henderson. Move. Watch this. Landers is going to stop, go. Henderson's right in phase, and then what happens? Pass interference. Wilson had a chance as well, but what a run by Swift. To the 24, and now Fromm throwing to the corner. Oh, just man. off the hands of Matt Landers. Produced a matchup with Cager go going against, no, excuse me, Landers going against a linebacker to the outside. Amari Bruni is going, oh my gosh. I Two to snap it. There's the clap, and there's the ball. Fromm zips it in to Matt Landers. That ball comes out, and they're going to say incomplete. Well, this is the inconsistency of these Georgia wide receivers. This time Landers does a nice job finding the hole, getting the football, and he turns up field, and the ball comes out. From across the middle, incomplete intended for Matt in the heat. Here they come. From lofts it to the corner. And this one's knocked away. Nice play by Roger McCreary. Well, you could see what the... That's for Georgia Tech to maybe get off the field. With great field position for the dogs. From under pressure. Extending the play. Short hops one to the sideline. I just, all right, I'm just going to launch this to Calvin. Sure enough, 35 yards later in a completion. I was like, okay, that was relatively easy. It looked a little hard for Georgia. Use number four today. That's in bad with a chance to put one in the air. Sidearms won easily for a first down. Landers knocked out of bounds. Just shy of the 15 yard right in the Georgia backfield. From gonna go deep down the sideline, and that one is caught by Landers. 
They waved it out of bounds. If this deserves a replay, because it was caught. Stingley pushes him wide. Another perfect throw. Now, left foot came down first, I believe, and out of bounds. That's part of the coverage. But look who's starting off hot in this game. And we've talked about it in this building. Let's see what Fox can get a completion underneath if he can get a pass away. And now he's over the line of scrimmage, I think. Completes it. The Georgia fans are going to get excited, but I think this thing's coming back. Landers goes out of bounds. Second down at the 37 of LSU. From break, break, the break. out, got it complete out to it came Matt out, Landers. Well, it came out right at the end, I think. Stingley's on coverage. He had it, but watch Stingley get his hands on Landers had a shot, couldn't come up with you it. you got to make that catch. you got to help the quarterback. Absolutely. I, I think he... Blitz coming from throws up in the air. Again, Landers can't hold it. Two great players. Landers is open, gets inside. Perfect throw. Can do oh, great job by Derek Stingley. It sure was. Come on, that's hard. It's hard to play man to man all over the field. Don't like Dan landing on the other side, one of the five finalists for the Broyles Award. 63-year-old veteran of 42 years in coaching. Matt Landers, second down and eight, under two minutes to go in the half. Georgia leading 13 to nothing. From to the end zone, caught, touchdown, Matt Landers. That I talked about with Pickett. Watch the corner jump outside. He runs the post and the ball is right on him before the safety can get over there to help. It's the exact same route that he didn't take the shot to Pickens and they settle for the field goal. This time he gives Landers a shot. And they come up with a touchdown, we think. Yeah, I wonder if this is going to be looked against this Baylor defense. They send Kenny McIntosh out. Here's Matt Landers. And he gets stood up and driven down.